Hmm, what beer do I want to try next? Beer time, it's beer time with the beer man. From Belching Beaver out of Oceanside, California. Yeah, it's their Viva La Beaver. It's the Mexican chocolate milk peanut, peanut butter, butter milk, milk stout. It is at 7.5% ABV, and I didn't get any IBUs or any other information except for flavor, but I didn't really want to put that on here or tell you what it was until I tasted it. So, um, but pretty much you get the gist peanut butter milk stout so with uh, i think it has like cinnamon and some other stuff in it but uh, i already opened it on accident so i had to oh, get on. fast so uh, here we go let's open it does it have a date is what i want to know 22720 so let's say march a Mar so it's a month old hmm version of 16 part of the independent craft brewing association Oh, nice. Damn good times, it says. All right, let's do it. Well, we have a nice little cascade of colors going on there. That's cool. Kind of like a nitro style. Uh, not really, though. We got about two finger head here. Let's go for the smell. Oh, dude. Super peanut butter, very nutty tasting. Got that peanut butter comes right through that stout. It's a sweeter, roasty uh, chocolate stout for sure. It's got the roast. You get the peanut butter in there big time. I mean, hardcore saturated with peanut butter. I get a, maybe a few more little spices in there and stuff that I'm getting out of this on the nose. Let's go for the look. We got a very soapy looking head. It's very fr. Um, it's just the, the texture of it's very delicate. It looks like if you touch it, it would just go blah. Seven and a half percent, it's not too high, but the retention's going, it's not very good. It's going down pretty quick on the head. Um, see if there's any lacing kind of flowing. Just kind of drops, kind of heavy like. Doesn't stick on the sides. It's got a uh, kind of a medium, medium, a little over medium uh, uh, for uh, carbonation level is pretty medium, uh, medium to fast. Let's say it's kind of a darker brown, but it is opaque. Can't see through it, so it looks black. But it also has that brown tinge at the bottom that you can see through the light. Cheers, let's drink it. Mm. Kind of a milk chocolate, milk chocolate with that peanut butter. Very nutty, that peanut butter nutty though, like a peanutty nutty taste in that chocolate. They both are, it's it's made pretty balanced though. It's not the greatest flavor to me. I don't really like peanut butter so much. I don't like peanut butter in beer. Um, I'd rather have it on a peanut butter and jelly sandwich or something like that. <laughs> uh, it's not, it's not terrible. It's cut, it's kind of, it starts out real s smooth and soft and well rounded on the mouthfeel put in uh, not too much carbonation kind of um, goes on back to uh, kind of a it lathers your your tongue and your and your palate with this like peanutty kind of flavor hmm peanutty and you, at first you got it you get a pinch of that milk chocolate and then it pushes into this burst of peanut uh, spice wise I don't really get Dark roast, very sweet malt roast, roasted malt, very sweet roasted malt. But it's 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 kind of um, in a way it's kind of disturbing. I don't really like the peanut butter. It, it 
you know, it's kind of off-putting in a way. Well, that shit's whack, man. It's hard to, personally for me, someone else might like it, but I, I'm just not, it's not the greatest. <laughs> Has kind of a chalky, dry feeling in the back, but it is a longer finish and it kind of stays on your tongue uh, a little too long, even. With that peanut butter, if you don't like the peanut butter, it's going to stay there a while, folks, so. Oh. Um, I mean, yeah. Right on out of five hops. Uh, I mean, I'll, I'll, I'll give it a mid score. I'll give it a three. It's not bad, but it's not the great. It's not, it's not something I would probably buy again. Yeah, it was worth a shot, though, to try out to see what it's all about. Uh, Belton Beaver makes pretty good beef. <laughs> it's pretty good beaver. Belty Beaver makes some pretty good beer, though. Uh, on the, for the most part, I really like their stuff. Their other, they had a the other peanut butter one that wasn't that great either. I didn't. I just don't like peanut butter in beer. That's all. I mean, it has nothing to do with the beer itself. The stout around it all was actually pretty good. It's the peanut butter that I'm kind of like, eh. I'm telling you, this is really kind of weird. Anyway, um, thank you so much. I really appreciate it. Uh, I really appreciate your feedback as well. If you've had this before, let me know what you think. And if uh, there's a beer out there that you'd like me to try, please let me know also. If you haven't already, please hit the subscribe button, turn it red to gray, turn it from red to gray, and uh, hit the bell. You'll be informed when I have new shows coming up. And also on the way out, please hit the like button and share it out. Thank you so much. Guys, thank you. Much love. Cheers. And stay safe, of course.